क्वेश्चन इज गिवन स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ x माइनस सेवन इज इक्वल टू स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ x माइनस सेवन वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ x हियर हाउ वी कैन फाइंड आउट लेट्स सी सॉल्यूशन फर्स्ट व्हाट इज गिवन स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ x सॉल्यूशन स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ x माइनस सेवन इज इक्वल टू स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ x माइनस सेवन नाउ वी नो दैट if a is equal to square root of b this is given and square root of b is greater than equal to 0 so at that time we can say b is greater than equal to 0 and because square root of b is equal to a so we can say a is also greater than equal to 0 right now using this uh, condition here we can say x minus 7 x minus seven is greater than equal to zero, right? Therefore, we can say x is greater than equal to seven, and this is equation number one. Now, if this one square root of x minus seven, if square root of x minus seven is greater than equal to zero, because we know that a is equal to square root of b, that's why we are taking here a. A is greater than equal to zero. so we can write square root of x is greater than equal to 7 right so if we are taking here a square both side then we will get x is equal to x is greater than equal to 49 so this is equation number 2 that is x is greater than equal to 49 right now In third condition, we can say square root of x minus seven is equal to square root of x minus seven. This is given. If this is given, and we can here take square, then taking square both sides, then we will get square root of x minus seven whole square is equal to Square root of x minus seven whole square, right? Now square root of x and here square. So this uh, square root cancel from square. So we can write this x minus. Now this one seven uh, square that is forty nine. So we can write this plus forty nine. We are using a minus b whole square formula. So forty nine minus two ab two square root of x times Seven, right? A square plus b square minus two ab is equal to. Now here, square and square root cancel, so we can write this x minus seven. Now, x x, so we can cancel this one. Now, left term that is forty nine minus seven two is a fourteen minus fourteen square root of x is equal to minus seven. Now we can write this fourteen square root of x is equal to forty nine plus seven. We are arranging this term here. So fourteen x fourteen square root of x this side and fourteen plus seven, right? Forty nine plus seven. Now is equal to we can write fourteen square root of x is equal to fifty six. So square root fourteen square root of x is equal to fifty six. So we can say square root of x is equal to fifty six divided by fourteen, right? So fourteen four zero fifty six. Therefore, square root of x is equal to four. Now we are if we are taking square both side, then square cancel here. X is equal to sixteen. This is the value of x in equation three. So we can say we got here three value. We got three value of x. That is, x is greater than equal to seven. This is from equation one, from one, and x is greater than equal to forty nine. This is from two, equation two, and x is equal to sixteen. This is from three, equation three. So from one, two, and three, we can't say uh, uh, this is means value of x is equal to 
uh, we got value of x so we can say here x is equal to 5 so therefore we can say x has no solution and this is the solution thank you